YouTube, we are at SEMA 2022, uh, very early flight to get to Vegas. This is setup day, so I'm in the main convention center and Toyota booth and uh, just kind of walking through. This is where we're going to get started. So because I can get in early, I'm going to take you around. My video will be about basically early morning stuff before the crowd gets here so I won't be doing much in some of the other halls I'm going to kind of stay to the middle because that's where I'm working all week but we'll see you there check this out set up set up pretty cool beautiful Mustang being debuted by Weaver Customs our friends in Utah brakes are done this will be outside so everybody can see it at the Adams car care booth. Beautiful, beautiful car. Weaver Customs opened the hood for us. Check that out. Big block Ford, fuel injected. Nice throttle stacks. Beautiful. Gonna be a little partial to some of the cars that have the Willwoods on them. Our boys, Caleb and Reggie, helped set this up. This is the new BRZ Street Hunter kit, TJ Hunt's car, rocking yellow Willwood kit on it with the yellow super light caliber. It's looking awesome. Love this color. Very cool. I know some of y'all don't like the new Integra, but Auto Tune Young T did a great job with this one, I think. The arrow is simple, but nice, really accentuates the lines, and yeah, look at that, more Willwood stuff, <laughs> looking awesome, yeah. yeah, I mean, it's free, pretty much, <laughs> <laughs> so, oh, yeah, definitely. nice quick ride through the tunnel, through the boring tunnel, through the ice. <laughs> That's cool. So I'm at West Hall. This is a lot of the off-road UTV stuff is in here. Um, I just rode the Tesla boring tunnel. That's what you just saw. That's a pretty cool way to get across because if not, it's about a mile walk from where our booth is where I'll be working all the way to this hall. And we got some of our buddies that'll be out there. If you like overlanding, there's a whole section of West Hall for it. Check that out. Had some awesome setups here. Bronco, Tacoma, Jeep. He knows a tech, he knows you tech. He knows a tech. The wrap company. They make this wrap, it's beautiful. This F40 is completely wrapped. This is not a paint job. This is some of the best looking wrap film I have ever seen. I am not in this part of the industry, but I see a lot of cars. And man, is that beautiful. I love the F40. Who doesn't love the F40? Check out this GTR. Check out that Lambo over there. That Porsche down there. I'm going to get this now because it's going to be heck of busy tomorrow around this car. This is the Chemblocks Hoonigans Hoonapig. Porsche bodied all-wheel drive Pikes Peak monster. Awesome, awesome, awesome. It's SEMA, everything and everything. These lifted trucks, I always get enough pictures of this for my nephew who loves these. My boy Nate, it's a bunch that way, but we're gonna cut it short and make a right. Just to show you all, I'm outside now, obviously, right in front of Central Hall, where you can see everybody's still setting up. So this will get a little bit more full. This thing is pretty awesome. So what I'm going to do is cut out and come back tomorrow morning when everything is actually set up. It is day two, or actually really day one, the first day, because it's not set up day to day, of SEMA, or the Old Fender Nationals, the Bluetooth Driveshaft Nationals, whatever you want to call it. No, it's SEMA. Anyhow, 
we're out here. It's about 7.15 in the morning. Uh, it's a nice morning. It's a little chilly, but not too bad. And uh, we're going to find some stuff. So keep it coming. And the Supra Mark IV. This looks really, really awesome. Mark IV. Very period correctly done. Project Mew brakes. Uh, it's got a Rydox lip kit on it. All the cool HKS livery. Beautiful, beautiful truck, or chat, sorry, beautiful, beautiful car. Bunch of goodies under the hood. Early morning, public's not here yet. E30 M3, this thing is awesome. Check out that engine bay. Bunch of radium fuel parts, ITBs, wide body. This thing is nice. Check out the interior. That stands out. I love that 80s print. Just a beautiful, beautiful E30. Benzo Bruth brought out this awesome Rod Millen Pikes Peak Toyota Tacoma. Legendary race car. If you don't know what this is, just go on YouTube and look up Rod Millen Pikes Peak and you'll see some sweet, sweet stuff. Awesome, Pennzoil FD RX-7. This thing is pretty, pretty cool. It's got a hydraulic handbrake on it. Oh, it's Conrad Grunwald's car. I wonder what he uses this for. No Conrad. Maybe we'll see him this weekend and ask. This is awesome. She got that dump pipe. There's a big old turbo in there. Very cool. Trucks aren't everywhere's cup of tea, but when they're done right, they are pretty cool. I've said that many times, and this one is functional with both connecting drive shafts. She got that center section. Look at all that work. Very cool. Big old, I uh, believe this is an F350. Very nice. So we're inside, we're headed towards our work booth for the day. As you can see, now the carpet's laid down. Everything looks a lot more formal. Everybody's ready to roll. Everything's all set up from just yesterday where it was just concrete and bare. Seema's was ready to launch, about 30 minutes. This is one of the nicest R32s I have seen. Beautiful car cars its vendors back in industries the u.s supplier of volk racing wheels and many other things jdm oh just stuff here is another awesome nissan r32 this is in the vibrant performance booth vibrant makes a lot of metal fabrication components you know bends aluminum steel for headers intake pipes whatever you're building that's a beautiful engine bay check out that rb26 that's awesome it's the back end of the huda pig the gr corolla this is their rally inspired design. My small contribution is in there, the wood handbrake stuff. And you can't see the handle, it's right there. But if I'll post up the actual awesome pictures. Well, I would have already posted them by now, but functional oil air duct for oil cooling with the wing and everything this is the gr corolla in full rally spec fully functional it's an awesome vehicle it's great working with toyota and marty and the guys there to get all that little piece specked out very awesome day two sema we're here empty it's about 7 15 in the morning stay tuned awesome 
Skyline in the Exidy clutch booth. Very cool. It's early. Super Knife SDR X7 carbon doors. Awesome kit. Check out what's under the hood though. It's not a rotary. It's a 2J with a big old turbo. This is nice. Love this cup car. Porsche 911 center lock wheels. This is a serious race car. Very nice. This is the BASF booth. So you got the driver list. Super cool. I found Iron Maven. This is an all woman built car. Very cool. Our friend Crystal is part of this team. It's a Volvo. Love the color. So well built. Engine bay super clean. They revealed this yesterday. It's just so awesome. We have such awesome women in the automotive industry building some really, really cool stuff. Very awesome. Gintani bringing out some heat. Some nice McLarens and Lambos. Very cool. Jet. This is a UTV I could have some nice fun with eBay Motors booth unfortunately our great friend Amelia is not here this week she's doing awesome things and got busy but this is her infamous and famous C8 Corvette and uh yeah, this is just awesome. And uh, unfortunately, we get to see her during SEMA. And we won't be able to see her this year, but we miss you, Amelia. <laughs> Always awesome. Hey, we share the same birthday. Throttle Boys brought some heat this year. This is a Tesla powered, Willwood equipped 350Z, looking just awesome. Delivery is awesome. The color is awesome. Loving it. This is uh, Hoonigan Travis Prashtana's Subaru. If you watched the Goodwood Festival of Speed this year, you saw this thing haul butt down or up the Goodwood with its uh, air brakes opening up and stuff. Awesome car. Day three, SEMA, 7.30 in the morning. We're in the Central Hall. It's 47 degrees outside. We're at the Battle of the Builder area. We're going to get some info and see some cars. Beautiful wide body Cayman in the Battle of the Builders section of SEMA. Glass top engine cover for the middle. And that looks like it's custom. And now I'm getting ideas for ours. Beautiful lip kit, wide body awesome interior well, the builders car we like a lot look at the incredibly beautiful metal work on this custom made by the gentleman wiping down the car right there beautiful car check out the interior all business inside just awesome one of the nicest Ferraris here at SEMA. A beautiful case swapped turbocharged Ferrari wide body by Stance Works. Just a beautiful, beautiful build. Work on this for a while. And why the hell not? Do something different. And by the way, best Raiders on the market. 92 Carrera S here at Tech Art, right next to this beautiful take in. Tech art doing some cool stuff. I love the flat white with these turquoise blue accents. Looking awesome. Look like I don't know. This is the new okay. electric concept from Lexus. The Lexus Electrified Sport. As you can see there. I really hope they put this into production. This might be the nicest electric car I have ever seen. Beautiful. Holly Performance booth. This Mustang is awesome. Rear engine mounted, nitrous powered, 
sorry, mid-engine mounted, wide-bodied, 69-ish Mustang. Very cool. Another cool Integra. I know the Integra got a lot of heat, but this one is awesome. Here at the Tane booth. Check out this wide body. Auto Tunes is super nice as well, but this one's a little bit more on the extreme side. I think they did a great job with it. Love the pearl white. Hey, I have one of those Dompachis. I think I need one of these Dompachis. The Dodge booth this year in Central Hall brought some heat. Check that out. That is a TV screen, not a projector. And I want one. And it'd be cool to play video games on that. Right. This is day four, Friday, last day of the event. I'm only here for the morning. And then I head back home to Texas. And I gotta be at Circuit of the Americas tomorrow. I'll have to be, but I'm going to Circuit of the Americas tomorrow. We're gonna see a few of our friends racing the TA2 race. But let's finish day four. Okay. Full carbon bodied R32 GTR in the Battle of the Builders. Not one of the finalists, but still a beautiful car. Look at that radium fuel system, remote shocks, serious car, beautifully built. It is a time attack, super lap battle vehicle. One of the top four finalists for Battle of the Builders that will be announced later today. Unfortunately, I will not be there. I will be back in Texas by that point. But this is a beautiful roadster. Cantilever suspension. Look at that custom steering wheel. Look at the pumpkins on those ITVs. Check out the exhaust work. Very cool. One of my favorite cars of the week is this FDR X7 four rotor pushback full built suspension but I'm like built built Willwood 14 inch front 13 inch rears wide body fender beautiful RX-7 let's take a look at the Showbird 31 Chevy I'm gonna start here and end at the front look at this beautiful paint look at those cutouts for the rear fenders this is one of the nicest vehicles I have seen this weekend, this week, sorry. Check out the ghost Chevy emblems on the door. Now let's look at this engine. Look at the work on the engine. Follow the exhaust pipes and the intake all the way down to those turbos right there. Beautiful, beautiful car. Beautiful 57 Chevy in the hot rod section, Central Hall. Just an awesome, awesome color. Check out this interior. Beautifully done. Look at this beautiful dual, or sorry, twin cab C10 sitting on a roadster shop chassis. Looking good. Yes, sir. This is a beautiful C10. Awesome copper wheels, copper finish on the bed here in the TMI booth. Beautiful C10. This was my home. The office this whole week. Just a brief view. It's 8 o'clock. No one's here yet. All you Gran Turismo 1 fans, you know, from back in the day, check out this TVR Speed 12 very cool and right next to it y'all know how much I love these wagons another RS6 the thing is bad loving it check out these wheels they're actually big wheels this is the end of the lip and that's the top very cool this is the RWB 997 in the liquid Molly booth Royal World beautiful <laughs> Awesome wheels, look at that fender. Such a beautiful car. Toyo Tires always puts together a really nice display. It's the walkway between Central and South Hall. B 
beautiful slant nose Porsche. The Toyo tires, of course. Some nice Mercedes 300 SLs. Let's make our way down. We have a couple of beautiful cars down this way. Awesome BMW. Of course, I'm going to this RWB. Beautiful color. RWB Porsche. Yoshiwara is the name of this beautiful car. Check out the glass top. Awesome. Check out this E30, two JZ swapped. Looks like it's got a Willwood pedal assembly on it with some master cylinders. Really nice. Jump over. Forge carbon topped Lambo. Another beautiful Porsche wide fender. Let's jump over there. Sure. See plenty of posts of this guy already. FDRX7 with a V12. Let's zoom in on that. Check that out. Beautifully done. All the ducting. Beautiful color. Very nice. Purple carbon fiber R32 wide fendered full carbon body. I don't need to say much more about this one. There's a crowd behind me. I'm walking to the airport. Another SEMA in the books. SEMA 22. All gone. Done. Well, this ends in about four hours for everybody else, but I'm heading out. Hope y'all enjoy the video. Have a great week. Time to go to Coda tomorrow. God bless.